I'll stop there before I embarrass myself even more. All right, what's up, guys? For those of you who don't know, I'm a huge, huge, huge fan of Game of Thrones, so I thought I'd try out this Telltale game, um, Game of Thrones game. I uh, thought I'd do a little bit of a let's play. If you guys enjoy it, just leave a like and I'll upload some more of them. Let's get this thing started. I don't know if any of you played the Telltale Walking Dead game, but I guess as it says on the screen, it's tailored by how you play. So a lot of the choices I make are going to change how the game plays out. The fate of House Forrester hangs in the balance. The trout, the trout, the trout in the towers, the wolves got the fish and they all ran off. Hold up. Let me see. Yay, yay. Subtitles on. All right, let's do it. Jamie Lannister, Kingslayer, Oathbreaker, brought to his Puddles, knees by the, Lord the men Forrester. of the North. That must be me then. And set free by the women. You'd think he'd done it himself the way he tells it. Lord Forrester's sword won't clean itself, you know. Make sure it's spotless this time. Lord Forrester won't be happy with blood and brains all... Now that is a proper Hope I get sword. To use one I'll have one like it myself someday. You? You'll never have a sword like that. And I say that as a friend. I mean, if we're being honest. Don't, don't be a be an ass, Bowen. Apologies, your lordship. I had Andy, you know. <laughs> Hand him what? Capturing him. He was nowhere near the Kingslayer at the Whispering Wood. He was so drunk, he barely made it out of his tent. Next, he'll tell us he caught Tyrion, too. <laughs> so what really happened? Someone caught him, I suppose. That skinny man here, and they'll say it was them. You captured the Kingslayer. Aye. Well, I had a hand in it. Aye. And round his ankle as ten others took him down. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? I brought him to his knees. Lord Forrester. But not before he dragged you halfway across the battlefield on your face. You're questioning <laughs> Norrin's honor. I'm questioning Norrin's story, which grows more far-fetched every time he tells it. Get your liege lord some wine. Go on. It's your job. Right, thanks. You're welcome. Thank you, Garrett. I'll do it. Norrin's family has faithfully served House Forester for centuries. His honor is beyond reproach, and House Tully is forever in his debt. They've never seen a field plowed so well as the day the Kingslayer dragged poor Norrin across the battlefield. <laughs> Fetch your cup, the night we celebrate. To Rob Stark, the King in the North! The, the King, King in the North! Tomorrow, we march on Casterly Rock, and House Forrester has been given the greatest honor to lead the Young Wolf's army and ride as the vanguard! The gods have favored us. Onward to Casterly Rock! Aye! Death to the Lannisters! Aye! The North remembers! Aye! Aye! 
Got it. Yes, my lord? I need you to keep an eye out for Roderick. As his father, I could not be more proud of the man he's become. On a night like this, men find false courage at the bottom of their cups. I'd rather he were here. Yes, my lord. There's also the question of what's to be done with you. It's been on my mind for a while now. Something must be done. With me, my lord? You've served House Forrester well for several years now, but I can't expect you to squire forever. How shall I reward your loyalty? What you already know I, I want to start you? slaying some cats. Let me fight for you, my lord. You've more than proven your ability on the battlefield. No man would question that. There were those who had their doubts when your uncle put forth your name as my squire. But you've erased those doubts entirely. It would be an honor to see you riding by Roderick's side in the vanguard tomorrow. Not as a squire, but as the equal of any man who serves House Forrester. It's well deserved, Garrett. Thank you, my lord. I promise. I won't let you down. That I don't doubt. But for now, keep this between us. We're celebrating tonight. I wouldn't want the other squires to feel discouraged. Yes, my lord. Now go, and find Roderick if you can. I will, my lord. Thank you. Bloody hell. Empty. Squire! Fetch us more wine! Can you give me a hand? Come on. Can I get up to you? Yeah, no problem. I have been a squire longer than you. So? I outrank you. You should help me. I'm in line for a promotion, bruh. You just don't know it yet. Fetch more wine, scrub my armor, clean my boots. Just my luck to end up with Norin while you serve the Lord. Let him fetch his own wine for once. He's a drunk, a liar, and an arrogant prick. You'd better watch your tongue, boy. It could be much worse. What the fuck do you know about it? Nothing is worse than Norin. See, that's why you're lucky. Low expectations. If I'd grown up covered in pig shit, shovel and slop, well, maybe I'd think saddling his horse was the greatest honor in the Seven Kingdoms. I suppose this beats pig farming. He's gonna try to hold me. Just shut your mouth. It's the truth. It's not like I'm making it up. <laughs> All I'm saying is, at this rate, we'll never be more than this, which is nothing. The lowest of the low. For all I know, we could be squires for life. Pulling wine around a fucking wedding. Give it time. You'll get there. More easy for you to say. Maybe if my uncle were castling at House Forester, I'd feel different. Who my uncle is has nothing to do with it. How much further? Well, it's right over there. The Red Wedding? Oh, no. The Game of Thrones fans should know what's Take up right time. now. If you haven't you watched it before, just stay tuned. Good thing Lord Walders in a generous mood. Fucking phrase. Nice night for a wedding. Suspicious. Not often he finds a willing husband for one of his daughters. Don't expect me to carry it for you, Sir Garrett. What? What's Garrett, wrong? Step your game up. Hurry up, man. Just gotten into you. You're acting rather odd. We need to get back. Now. They're fine. They can wait. No, you don't understand. We need to go up. And <laughs> take the fucking flagon already. What's wrong with him? Something the matter? Bowen, we have to go. You go if you're in such a rush. Oh no, what do I do? What do I do? Uh, save the bro. Save bro. But save the bro. What, about? what the hell was that about? Slow down, would you? Bro. What? Run! We need to get back to camp. Oh. Make a move. Oh! Run, Ray! Garrett, we have to get back. 
Oh. Oh snap. <laughs> My bad. I didn't know I was in control there. Oh, oh, good save. Oh, Oh, you ain't gonna stop me, cuz. Oh, have fun with that. <laughs> Call his name, let him pay attention to his fight, bro. Oh. Oh. Why can't I move? Jeez, he's effed up. Guard this with your life. Return it to Ironrath where it belongs. There's no time to waste. I'll be damned if I let it fall into the hearts of those traitors. What the phrase you have to go. You're welcome to the fucking torch. I, I won't leave you, you my lord. Can, and you will. My lord, By I... the gods, you will obey me. Tell your uncle. <laughs> Tell him. The North Grove must never be lost. Tell no one but him. 
Do you understand? You must swear. Tell only your uncle Duncan. I swear that I will, my lord. Hey, it's those foresters. On your honor, you must do this for your house. Go! Kill those <laughs> fucking foresters! <laughs> 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 We love you. Oh.